Top 10 Richest Comedians in the World and Their Net Worth, 2023 In recent years, the comedy industry has been experiencing an unexpected boom, producing fascinating personalities such as Calvin Hart, Martin Lawrence, Steve Harvey, Rowan Atkinson, and many others. These people have not only acquired fame through their ability to draw out humor from our everyday experiences but have also gathered some measurable amount of wealth. The rise of streaming services has meant that more people are willing to pay for quality content. Consequently yielding an increase in the amount of money that comedians are able to earn. According to Forbes magazine, all the top 10 richest comedians in the world are worth over $400 million. The list includes some of the most successful stand-up comedians, as well as some of the most popular names in sitcoms and movies. Although all the comedians on this list are based in the United States, it is imperative to note that the comedy industry has produced multi-millionaires in different parts of the world who did not make it to the list of the top 10. Top 10 richest comedians in the world, Forbes. The table below contains the names and respective net worths of the top 10 richest comedians in the world as estimated by Forbes magazine. Rank Comedian Net Worth 1. Jerry Seinfeld $950 million 2. Byron Allen $800 million 3. Matt Stone $700 million 4. Matt Groening $600 million 5. Trey Parker $600 million 6. DeGeneres $500 million 7. Jay Leno $450 million 8. Adam Sandler $440 million 9. Bill Cosby $400 million 10. David Letterman $400 million Who are the richest comedians in the world, 2023? Really, who are these top 10 world's richest comedians? How did they begin their career? At what point did they attain prominence? And most importantly, did they become this wealthy through comedy alone or did they have other business ventures slash investments? Well, let's find out. 1. Jerry Seinfeld, $950 million With a net worth of $950 million, Jerry Seinfeld takes the lead as the richest comedian in the world, according to Forbes magazine. Seinfeld is considered the king of comedy in the United States. He became prominent in comedy for playing a semi-fictionalized version of himself in the sitcom Seinfeld, which he created and wrote with Larry David. The show aired on NBC from 1989 until 1998, becoming one of the most acclaimed and popular American sitcoms of all time. According to Forbes magazine, Jerry Seinfeld is one of the highest paid comedians ever. In 1998 alone, Jerry Seinfeld earned $267 million from the show, Seinfeld. The show saw Seinfeld's earnings grow from $40,000 per episode to $1 million per episode, by the show's ninth and final season. Based on records, Jerry Seinfeld has been the highest paid comedian in recent years. According to Forbes, Seinfeld's cumulative earnings from Seinfeld as of 2004 were $267 million. In furtherance, he earned $100 million from syndication deals and stand-up performances in 2004, and $60 million in 2006. Between 2008 and 2009, Seinfeld earned a total of $85 million, making him the world's highest paid comedian that year. In 2019, Netflix reportedly acquired the global streaming rights for Seinfeld at a hefty sum of $500 million. 2. Matt Stone, $700 million Popular American animator and voice artist, Matt Stone began to attain the limelight after creating and producing South Park, a popular animated American sitcom in 1997, alongside Trey Parker, his creative partner. According to CNN, the pilot episode of South Park was made on a budget of $300,000 but had generated over $30 million in t-shirt sales alone before the first episode was even aired. In 2011, Stone and Parker along with Robert Lopez staged one of the most satirical and controversial plays, The Book of Mormon. According to Huffington Post, 
the musical comedy managed to be the biggest mainstream theater hit of the decade, having grossed over $500 million. By 2013, Matt Stone and Trey Parker launched Important Studios, a film production company that was valued at $300 million, thanks in part to the revenue from the Book of Mormon and South Park. In 2021, Stone and Parker signed a $900 million deal with Viacom CBS to make six additional seasons of South Park and 14 movies in the South Park universe for streaming. With an impressive net worth of $800 million, Matt Stone is only second to Jerry Seinfeld as the richest comedian in the world. The executive producer of The Simpsons, Matt Groening takes the third position among Forbes' richest comedians in the world in 2023 with a net worth of $600 million. Although Matt is the producer of some other projects such as Life in Hell and Futurama, he reportedly made most of his earnings from The Simpsons, which is the longest-running U.S. primetime television series in history and the longest-running U.S. animated series and sitcom. Aside from amassing the bulk of his wealth from the show, he has also won multiple significant awards for the show such as 13 Primetime Emmy Awards, a British Comedy Award for Outstanding Contribution to Comedy in 2004, and a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame on February 14, 2012. As earlier stated, Trey Parker was a co-producer along with Matt Stone for the popular American animated sitcom, South Park which generated a lot of wealth for the duo. The duo also collaborated on another sitcom called The Book of Mormon, which earned them four Tony Awards and one Grammy Award. They also have five Primetime Emmy Awards and one Oscar Award for his work on South Park. 5 Ellen DeGeneres, $500 million With a net worth of $500 million, Ellen DeGeneres is the richest female comedian in the world in 2023. Ellen began her career as a stand-up comedian in the 1980s before moving into acting where she starred in her sitcom Ellen, 1994-1998. Thereafter, she began to host her syndicated television talk show, The Ellen DeGeneres Show, in 2003. In 2021, she announced plans to end the talk show after almost two decades. According to Forbes, Ellen DeGeneres is the 15th highest paid entertainer in the world, earning over $87.5 million in just 2018. She was also named the 50th most powerful woman in the world and second on the World Pride Power list. 6. Jay Leno, $450 million Jay Leno is another American television host who has amassed a net worth of $450 million over his career. Leno is most famous for his work on The Tonight Show with Jay Leno on NBC and is regarded as one of America's most popular TV hosts. Before his emergence as a television host, Leno has been on TV for years performing as a stand-up comedian and as an actor. Although Jay Leno made most of his fortune as a host of a TV show with over 4 million audience, he claimed that he has not spent any of the money he earned from the show, but lives off of his money from his stand-up routines. 7. Byron Allen, $800 million Byron Allen is the head of the U.S. entertainment company, Entertainment Studios. The businessman and comedian began his career as a stand-up comedian at the age of 14. Initially, he performed on amateur nights at comedy clubs throughout Los Angeles but was later invited by Jimmy Walker to join his comedy writing team alongside Jay Leno and David Letterman. Meanwhile, he made his television debut at age 18 on The Tonight Show starring Johnny Carson, before he began his show Kickin' It with Byron Allen in 1992, which ran for more than 21 seasons. Allen is generally considered one of the major stakeholders in the entertainment business. His net worth of $800 million is a testament to his stronghold in the world of comedy and entertainment. 8. Adam Sandler, $440 million popular American actor, comedian, and producer, Adam Sandler also makes the list of one of the richest comedians in the world in 2023, with a net worth of $440 million. He rose to fame following his role as a cast member on Saturday Night Live before going on to star in Hollywood films. According to Celebrity Net Worth, Sandler charges at least $20 million per movie which makes him one of Hollywood's highest paid actors. 
In 2021, he landed a $250 million for movie deal with Netflix. Despite the huge paycheck offered, Netflix had to convince him that they were a good fit, especially since its subscribers had spent over 2 billion hours watching Sandler's original content from 2015 to 2020. 9. Bill Cosby, $400 million The legendary American comedian, Bill Cosby began his career as a stand-up comedian in the 1960s and became prominent for the several stand-up comedy records he released through the decades. As of October 2022, he has a net worth of $400 million. Aside from his comedy records, Bill has starred in several television shows and sitcoms such as I Spy, 1965-1968, The Bill Cosby Show, 1969-1971, Fat Albert and the Cosby Kids, 1972-1985, etc. Bill's participation in the entertainment industry won him several awards including five consecutive Grammy Awards for Best Comedy Album from 1965 to 1970 Cosby also made history when he won the Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Lead Actor in a Drama Series in 1966. 10. David Letterman, $400 million The legendary American television host, David concludes the list with a net worth of $400 million. Like every television host on the list, David Letterman began his career as a stand-up comedian but diverted into broadcasting as an announcer and newscaster at the college's student-run radio station. David who hosted late-night television talk shows for 33 years, reportedly earned at least $14 million in a single year and earned as high as $40 million as of 2007. Aside from the massive wealth he made as a television host, he also won numerous awards such as 12 Emmy Awards, and 4 American Comedy Awards, and in 2011 became the first recipient of the Johnny Carson Award for Comedic Excellence at the Comedy Awards. Wrapping up With the ever-growing popularity of comedy, it is no surprise that comedians are some of the richest entertainers in the world. Here is a recap of the top 10 richest comedians in the world, 